this lesson, building a three-dimensional object from two-dimensional views will take you through two examples, giving you the two-dimensional views and helping you put together the actual three-dimensional object. We'll begin by giving you the front side, top side, left side, and right side views of our object. A good place to start is by noticing the dimensions. We can tell by looking at the front, left, and right side that this object is three blocks high. We know that the bottom block must be blue, and there must be a blue block on top of this block. We know that the third block must be a yellow block. By looking at the top side, we know that this is only one block wide. From looking at the top side, left side and right side, we can tell that this object is three blocks deep. We can deduce from those three sides that it must be a yellow block in front of our first yellow block, and there must be a red block behind the middle blue block. This is our three-dimensional object. Always do a check from the three-dimensional object to make sure the two-dimensional side views all make sense. Let's try a tougher example. We'll give you the front side, top side, left side, and right side views. Remember those dark lines means that there is a depth discrepancy. Let's start with our dimensions again. We can tell from the front, left, and right side our object is three blocks high. We know that the bottom middle block must be a red block, and then on top of that, looking from the left side, there must be two green blocks. We know that the object is three blocks deep, judging from the top side, left side, and right side again. We know that there must be a green block in front of our other green block. There must be a red block attached to the bottom red block, looking at the left side. Next, we'll figure out how wide this object is, and we can tell by looking at the top side and the front side that this object is also three blocks wide. The two blocks on the bottom Looking at the right side, they have to be at the back. But looking at the front side, we know there must be another blue block on top of that middle blue block. Let's check all our views and the discrepancies in the depths and make sure it all makes sense. And I think you'll find that it does.